following in the footsteps of Japan and the United States of America, India has grounded all six of the Boeing 787 Dreamliner aircrafts operated by state-owned carrier Air India for an indefinite period. The Directorate General of Civil Aviation was due to take a decision on the matter after Boeing submitted its report by the end of January 16th after a series of incidents heightened safety concerns over the plane. The regulator had formed a team to work with Boeing to judge the safety of the aircraft. See, what FAA said, it's, it's, they have issued an advisory uh, worldwide that to ground all uh, 787s uh, because of, until they can prove batteries are safe. So basically what they're saying is they'll check the system, all systems and all planes uh, because of this battery problem. Uh, and uh, I have directed the DGCA to issue ground all the dreamliners here also. Now, how serious is the problem, how long it will take, we'll know only a couple of days. Uh, but uh, there are about 50 dreamliners in operation for more than a year, and they have flown more than 50,000 miles. So let's uh, hope they can find a solution soon. You know, certainly we will not uh, fly dreamliner unless uh, FAA and our own DGCA gives a clearance. See, so far only the incidents had basically happened in Japan. And Japan Airlines, both of them, ANA and JAL, were the only ones who had grounded planes. United hadn't done it, Ethiopia hadn't done it, other airlines hadn't done it, and DGC was in constant touch with FAA. Now that FAA has said that they want to check this electrical system in all the planes, so we will ground them. See, my, uh, what I think is and what I know is that uh, Boeing has to come up uh, with a plan for FAA to test all the, these electrical systems and batteries. So when that uh, plan comes up, we will also test them. But uh, basically, first FAA has to approve uh, that uh, they are safe to fly. Meanwhile, Japan's two leading airlines have grounded their Boeing Dreamliners soon after one of the Dreamliners landed in emergency. It is the latest and most serious incident to hit the Dreamliner, which is the world's first mainly carbon composite airliner. Correspondent Ashutosh from New Delhi for ANI.